romance between Justin Bieber and Selena Gomez has taken a new turn. Shortly after a report said she was done with him, he opened up to fans in what seems to be a coded way. Selena Gomez, 25, and Justin Bieber, 24, have kept us guessing with their rocky relationship for years. But on May 9 the source claimed that Selena is over her ex for good. In fact the insider claimed that she has completely moved on and is not interested in getting back together with him anytime soon, according to E! News. The source added, she respects him as a person but has decided she is much happier doing her own thing. Selena rarely even talks about Justin anymore, and is fully open to dating. Just over 90 minutes after that news dropped on the website, Justin took to his Instagram stories to post the screen grab of a song that he has been listening Tom writing that it, really helped me today. The song is called Cycles, and it's by gospel singer Jonathan McReynolds. It appears on his Make Room album and it features the artist Doe. Now, it could be just a coincidence but the lyrics of the song address an issue that keeps on reoccurring. The first verse says, didn't I conquer this last year? Tell me what I missed cause I fear Thady's coming back up again. Must be something I ate. Some song, some show, some hate. The song continues, the devil wants to extend the game, free throws. And when it ends he wants to make the sequel. Cause if he has another chance he feels like he can take my joy, my peace, my faith. Of course Justin has been very vocal about his Christian faith, so the words and the chorus in particular are totally in line with those beliefs. In the chorus Doe and Jonathan sing, see the devil, he learns from your mistakes, even if you don't. That's how he keeps you in cycles, 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 cycles. But I'm not going in cycles, cycles, meanwhile in the second verse Doe sings, this will end like I want it to. I win. But when you consider that Selena and Justin's romance has been going in cycles, you can see why the words of that song are also relevant to their up and down relationship, which stretches back, officially, to 2011 when they were still in their teens.